what is going on everybody welcome back to another youtube video um first up guys because you guys probably already know what the video is because of the title and the thumbnail i just want to give a quick little shout out um to my brother my best friend um aj he's one of my best friends as you guys already know and so he is the inspiration for this video um so real quick i wanted to change up um you know some of the content on this video and so that's why i'm doing what i am doing today but um so quick little disclaimer i've always loved baseball um baseball has always been one of my favorite sports um but um i always loved the sport of basketball you know just a little bit more um as a lot of you guys know i'm from new york and and one of the biggest sports in in new york is basketball and so I don't know if it was just a little bit of that New York in me that was coming out for loving the game of basketball. But um, as of recent, like, I really have not felt that way about basketball. Like, I haven't, like, like, I don't know if it's a phase you could call it maybe. Or maybe it isn't a phase, but um, just something as of recent just, like, interests me. And now everything about me is, like, I'm just loving baseball, and you know, um, I'm a Yankees fan, um, born and raised Yankees fan, um, you know, spring, tra spring training, we're, we're playing spring training, you know, we beat the, uh, Pirates today, 7-5, um, in spring training, you know, we've been, uh, we're, we're in a couple game streak now, I mean, we've, we've won and lost in spring training, we've gotten a couple wins, but, I mean, if we go back a couple games, we lost 15-0 to the uh, Phillies um, a couple games ago. Um, you know, so um, spring training's been interesting for us. But, yeah, anyway, so I just want to say a quick shout-out to AJ because he's inspiring me to, you know, you know do this. And so, um, yeah, and so, so uh, yeah, if you guys are wondering what hat I'm wearing, anytime I do a baseball video, I'm going to either be wearing one out of two hats so the first one is this is a connecticut tigers um minor league uh baseball team uh they play out in connecticut uh and they're called the connecticut tigers they are the minor the minor they were the minor league team for the detroit tigers i don't know why they played in connecticut but we me Asia, and gavin actually went camping about almost three this summer will be three years it's been it was august of 2018 and we went to a game, and I got this hat, and I've loved this hat. And the other hat you'll see me wearing is a New York Yankees hat, because you know that's my team. So this, so the Tigers are my favorite minor league team, and the reason why I say that is because when I went to that game, the players were really cool. You know, management was cool. I think I ended up getting a ball from that game, too. Where's that ball today? I have no idea. Um, but they were really cool, and, and I really had a really good time in Connecticut. And so I, that that's that that's why they are my favorite uh, minor league team, or I would be wearing a set. But I'm done rambling. Let's get straight into the MLB card collection. And so here is a binder full of my cards. I don't have too many. Um, you know, I've had cards and I, like they were in, in my drawer, and then I was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna sleeve them. And now I'm just, again, just something in me just sparked. And, and all of a sudden, I'm in love now. So, you know, I, I it may be a phase, but we'll see. And so, uh, hopefully, I'll be getting cards soon. But, um, yeah, so the first couple of pages, the first one, two, three, four, five, six, and a half pages are old school cards. And then the rest is... Um, a bunch of opening day 2018 cards and so the first five cards are new york teams the first three are the new york yankees and then the first two are two new york mets I'm, I'm a yankees fan but because the mets are in new york i support them the very littlest bit anyway we shall you know start and so i will bring you guys down here so you guys could see so the first card we have here is a American League Tops Dream Team Don Mattingly Kmart exclusive. You could see the mustache himself right there. Next, we have a center field Cardwell Washington, also from the Yankees. 
And then we have a Dan Pasqua outfielder, also from the New York Yankees. Going down to the Mets, we have Derek Bell, New York Mets outfield. It, that's a Fleer Traditions, too. And then we have a David Cohn pitcher for the New York Mets. And then I don't know what that means on the top, but if anyone knows, um, let me know. We got And then from the Expos, who remembers the Expos? Got Floyd Yeomans. He was a pitcher. Next, we got uh, Mike Drayett. I don't know how to say that last name. I, I am a, apologizing now. He's an OF for the San Francisco Giants. And then we got uh, a TB, Gary Goretti. Uh, he played for the Minnesota Twins. And then we got an RB, Tom Hank. It's not Tom Hank. Tom Henke. I don't know how to say that. Blue Jays. And then the back, if you guys want to pause the video at all, Read their stats. I will let you guys do that real quick. I'll let you put you guys. I'll zoom in so then if you guys are interested in actually, you know, by by chance at all, you know, interested in reading their stats, you guys could be my guest. There's gonna be all types of angles in this video for you guys uh, i'm recording off my phone because it's all right it's difficult that could have... all right second page we have a sb jim pankovitz played for the Houston nastros and then we got another flair tradition um alex Osha season highlights, and he at this time he was the new Grand Slam record champion um, of August twenty first two thousand. Followed up with the Terry Clark of the um, Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim. Sorry guys, if you know this video is a little like you know weird with the angles and stuff of some of the cards this is one of my first times doing a video like this and so it's all new to me bear with me as time goes on and if i was to do more of these videos i will you know obviously get better but we have a jeff tried away uh 2b for the reds we have an rp rick anderson for the royals we have a dh jim rice for the red sox we have a cf uh, Joe Carter for the Indians, and RF Tony Guan Gwyn, sorry if I pronounced that wrong, for the Padres, and we have a first baseman, Sean Casey, number 21 for the Cincinnati Reds. This video is going to be lo a little bit on the longer side, guys, so just bear with me. There are all their stats. Again, I'll just keep it like this, and then you guys could turn... The uh, turn your device however you like. Sorry, guys, if you guys see any background noise, that's my siblings. All right, all right. Next, we have a 2B from the Indians, Julio Franco. We have John Franco, pitcher of the Cincinnati Reds. We have Kent Bodenfield. He was a pitcher for the Philadelphia Phillies. And the next two, I really don't know too much about these cards. If anyone who watches this video knows anything about these cards and you want to comment down in the comment section down below and let me know some more info about these, I will be extremely thankful um but they're both from the los angeles dodgers we have eric um caros and karim garcia they are bellman i think that's how you pronounce it bellman cards and here are a picture of them 
Next, we have from the Pirates, we have uh, Pat Clements, pitcher. And then here's another one of these cards, like uh, the Kent Battlefield. We have Brett Boone, San Diego Padres, second base. We have a Steven Carlton pitcher for the uh, Phillies. I think that's the old logo. I could be mistaken, but I'm pretty positive. And then for the Giants, again, we have Mark Davis, another pitcher. Again, here are all their stats. If you guys would like to pause. Not going to lie, I kind of was running out a, a little bit out of video ideas. And so I said, perfect, let's try this. And so that's exactly what we're doing. Next page, we have a Juan uh, Berdenger. Again, sorry if I pronounced that. I really don't know how to pronounce some of these last names, guys. So I do apologize for that. Um, but he played for. He was a pitcher for the Minnesota Twins. Next, we have another uh, Fernand. Then we have for the Dodgers again, Ver Fernando Valenzuela. I know I'm gonna get roasted in the comments for pronounce. Like again, I really do apologize. He was a pitcher. I have a lot of pitchers. Jesus, I have a Dave Palmer. Uh, another pitcher for the Phillies. Uh, we have a center fielder, Willie McGee from the Cardinals. A Kurt Skilling, another pitcher for the Baltimore Orioles. Another Baltimore Orioles pitcher, Scott McGuire. We got Barry, Barry Lyons, a catcher for the New York Mets. We have a Padres left fielder, John Crook. And we have a Topps, uh, Tommy Green. And this card is special because this was uh, Tommy Green's September 10th, 1989 Major League debut. So this is his rookie card, I do believe. And so this card may be worth some money. I have no idea. And again, here are the stats. If you guys are at all interested, all right. I think yeah, this is my last full page of old school cards, and the next we have uh you know some old, but we go into the anyway. We have a pitcher for the, um, oh my god, um, that is the Brewers, Milwaukee Brewers. I couldn't think of their name for a second, so my bad on that. But Mark Who Hoosman, again, I am, I am very sorry if I do pronounce your name wrong. And then we have a shortstop. I think this is the first shortstop out of all of these cards so far. It's a buddy, um, being. Kalida, uh, played for the uh, Kansas City Rose. And then we have a OF, outfielder, uh, Pat Tabler, another shortstop for the Pittsburgh Pirates, Raphael Billiard, another pitcher for the Padres, Andy Hawkins, another Padres player, Benny um, Santiago. I'm going to get so much hate for not being able to pronounce last names. Uh, I'm sorry. So, uh, he was a catcher for the Padres. And then we have an, a Pirates right fielder, Darnell Coles. And then again, we have a season highlights. Scott Sheldon played for, at, in this uh, pitcher, the Texas Ragens with another Fleer tradition. Um, he, was, he played all nine positions on September 6th, 2000. And then we have... And an, we have a National League Tops Dream Team, Tony Gwynn. So I have, and it was a Kmart exclusive. So I have the National League uh, Dream Team card from the Kmart exclusive. And I also have the American League Dream Team um, Tops card that was at a Kmart exclusive. So I, be, I, meaning I have both of those in my collection. That is, though, that's very, you know, very nice, very rare. And I think I could get some money off of those too. Which would be nice. Um, 
But there it is, that. Wait, I'm reading this. It says Mariners. Mariners? I did not know the Mariners had this logo. I thought from that M, it was really Milwaukee. Uh, I thought this was the Brewers. I really did not know. That is a, a new fact to me. But um, that is very interesting to know. Wow. I really did not think the Mariners had that logo. I mean, looking at it now, knowing it kind of makes some sense to me. But yeah, I... Wow. Um... Okay, so because, guys, this is starting to get longer as a video, I'm going to stop after this, these next five cards, and I'm going to do a part two for all the newer cards. So this is all about the old cards. This is all the newer cards. But anyway, let's just keep going. So we have the Chicago White Sox, Greg Walker, a first baseman, and outfielder from the Athletics, Doug Jennings, a Stan Javier Athletics uh, outfielder, a pitcher, Greg Maddox, for the Chicago Cubs. And from the San Francisco Giants, we have a catcher, Bob Brentley. So, again, guys, these are all the older cards I have. Uh, I, I don't know if I could make any money off of these cards. I probably wouldn't want to sell them anyway. But, yeah. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy. And next video, we have many pages worth of the new cards. So, um, yeah, uh, guys, that is that. If any of you guys did like this and you guys want to see part two, make sure you guys subscribe, turn on post notifications, like this video, so I know you guys want to would want to see more of this. And um, thank you guys again so much for watching. It really does mean a lot to me. Um, I am starting to run out of some video ideas, so if you guys if you guys want me to start making videos you guys would want to see leave it down in the comment section down below on what kind of videos you guys would want to see and i will try my absolute hardest my absolute best to get to them and i will try to make you guys the videos you guys want to see anyway guys that is it for me if you guys do like what you see please like subscribe channel post notifications and i will guys see you in part two for all the newer cards see ya